Hello, my name is Colin Kill Caulfield, and I'm the head of the Department of Applied Maths and Theoretical Physics here at the University of Cambridge. It's my great pleasure to welcome you to this special open day for the Cambridge Centre for AI and Medicine, which Dant has the honour to be the host uh, department. In this little talk now, I would like to tell you a bit about how exciting a place in Cambridge is, and Dant in particular is, to do a PhD so that I can convince you that CCAIM is the right place for you. So DAMT is one of the two constituent departments of the Faculty of Mathematics at the University of Cambridge. The other constituent department being called the Department of Pure Mathematics and Mathematical Statistics. And we're both housed at the, the Center for Mathematical Sciences in Cambridge, which was opened in 2005 and is a custom built site for mathematicians from the, all over the world to work on exciting projects. There's about 120 uh, permanent academic staff here, about uh, 200 uh, postdocs, and nearly 400 PhD students now, all studying uh, various aspects of mathematical sciences broadly defined. And in particular, recently, we've become much more involved in the broad area of the mathematics of information, which of course involves AI and machine learning. And we have several centers that have sprung up to look at this uh, aspect, not just the Cambridge uh, Center for AI and Medicine, but also the um, uh, Cantab Capital Institute for the Mathematics of Information, I've got to read the names, the Center for Mathematical Imaging in Healthcare, and of course, the Cambridge Center for Data-Driven Discovery, which acts uh, to try and bring all these activities together across the university. And so I was so excited when I was able to be involved with uh, um, Mihaela van der Schaar and Andres Plotto in getting off the ground the Cambridge Centre for AI and Medicine. This wonderfully exciting partnership, not only between Cambridge Mathematics, the two departments, uh, Applied Maths and Theoretical Physics, and also uh, Pure Maths and Mathematical Statistics, but also the Medical School, the Judge, the uh, Computer Science, and all the various other parts of the uh, healthcare ecosystem around Cambridge, like the Sanger Institute, uh, the hospitals, and so on. And it's really an exciting opportunity right at this moment because of the incredible developments that are occurring in AI and machine learning in parallel with the great interesting challenges that are developing in the biological and healthcare sciences. And so this is just like such an exciting topic and such an exciting moment to be working on these things. And it's also such an exciting moment to be involved in such a new center as CCA because there is a cohort of like-minded people thinking about these crit critically important multidisciplinary problems, bringing together the best of uh, the mathematics and computer science and engineering underlying AI and machine learning with the fascinating problems from uh, uh, clinical and pharmaceutical uh, challenges in the healthcare space. I'm sorry, I trip over my words because it's such an exciting uh, opportunity and there's so many things I'd like to say. I hope you in this uh, session can find out not only about the interesting problems, but also hear about the experiences of the students who are within the CCA. Not all of them, of course, necessarily end up being registered in, in mathematics, in DAMT. They can be registered in different other departments. But a beautiful aspect is you're in this cohort, you will have a primary supervisor, you'll also have advisors who can look after you. And Cambridge, of course, is an amazing place to do a PhD, as I can personally attest, because not only do you have the wonderful intellectual environment of the departments and the faculties, but also then the incredible environments of the various colleges where you not only have pastoral support, but of course will be surrounded by a vast number of other incredibly uh, um, excited, like-minded uh, students who want to learn at such a wonderful world-class uh, university as Cambridge is, where you still have the the smallness of knowing people who all the people in your college in your in your staircase and so on, but also that you have the broader access to all the incredibly exciting things that are happening in the various uh, uh, departments and faculties and institutes in the university, because, of course, there are so many different visitors want to come here interesting seminars uh, to hear and great uh, uh, techniques and technologies new science being created all the time. 
So I really hope over the rest of this session, you can see that this is the place for you to come and do a PhD. And I hope to welcome you all uh, in person uh, in, a, in October when you can start again or in, later on perhaps at other times, when I can welcome you to the uh, exciting journey of doing a PhD in Cambridge at the Cambridge Centre for AI and Medicine. Of course, you'll hear more from the directors and the other students about how this uh, uh, center is working as it's uh, going along. But I just wanted to say it's right at the heart of our strategy in the university, the building up of uh, uh, AI, machine learning, data science in general, and applying it to crucial uh, societal problems of, of significance. And of course, the whole healthcare and medicine space is a critically important place uh, to, that we need to address, as you've seen, of course, over the last two years, but of course, also in other aspects of uh, therapeutics and treatment. It's a critically important way to apply science and mathematics and computer science and data science to understand and solve these problems. So enjoy this afternoon. Uh, please uh, uh, do uh, sign up and uh, all the very best with your future studies. So thank you very much for listening. Bye bye.